Okay everyone, so in this uh, Shopify tutorial for beginners part number one we're gonna learn how you can set up your uh, Shopify store with a free trial of 14 days, alright? So this will be a full playlist on how you can build your uh, Shopify store from scratch and this is part number one, so let's do this. Okay everyone, so welcome to this uh, Shopify tutorial for beginners in 2020. So in this uh, tutorial, we're gonna learn how you can build your own Shopify store from scratch, step by step, all right? So this will be a playlist with many videos that covers a specific topic. So in this first part, we're gonna learn how you can set up Shopify with a free trial. So this is the part number one. Okay, so let's do this. So if you go to the description below this video, you will find a link that will take you to this page, all right? Disclaimer, this link is an affiliate link. That means I will get a small commission if you use this link and decide to keep using Shopify after the 14 day free trial, okay? No extra cost for you, but you will support my channel so I can keep doing these tutorials, all right? So let's go below this video, click on the link, and this will take you to this page, okay? So this is the Shopify.com page where we can start our free Shopify trial for 14 days, all right? So if you want, you can read more about Shopify on this page. So start your business journey, sell everywhere, market your business, manage everything, so award-winning support, 24-7 support, Shopify App Store, so we can install apps to do certain things, all right? And you also can hire Shopify experts, okay? So to start your 14-day free trial on Shopify, just enter your email right here. Then click on start free trial. Now you can choose a password. And you can add a store name. Like so. And this store name you can change later on, so you don't need to have the perfect store name right away, okay? So I'm gonna show you how you can change this uh, later on in this uh, tutorial. Then click on create your store. Okay, so sit tight. And then you can answer some questions. So are you already selling? So you can choose one of these that uh, suits you the best. So I'm just playing around. I sell with a different system. I'm selling, just not online. I'm not selling products yet. Okay, so I'm just gonna click on, I'm just playing around. What is your current revenue? So choose one of these. Right now it's in Swedish. So I'm just gonna choose this one, it's up to $500. So are you setting up a store for a client? If you are, click on yes. If not, just leave it as it is, then click on next. So now we're gonna add an address so you can get paid. So this will be used as your default business address. Okay, so here you can add your first name, last name, address, apartment, your city, your zip, postal code and your country region phone number and also if you have a website a blog or something like that you can enter your business or personal website right here okay so i'm just gonna fill this uh, information up like so and after that just click on enter my store Okay, so now we have uh, set up our Shopify store 
And what we can do now is we can select a plan. So just click on select a plan. Okay, so pick a plan to use when your free trial ends. There's no risk. If Shopify isn't right for you, cancel before February 7 and we won't charge you. Okay, so you will see a specific date for you, 14 days from today. In my case, it's February 7. Okay, so here you see three different plans. We got the basic Shopify, we got Shopify and advanced Shopify. So if you are new to Shopify, you can start with uh, basic Shopify. It's $29 per month. And you can start selling your products online with your secure, beautiful store and in person at events, fairs and markets. Okay, so then we got credit card rates. So use Shopify payments to instantly accept credit cards. Simple rates with no setup or additional transaction fees. Okay, so you can see the price right here. You can have uh, two staff accounts. So staff accounts are in addition to the account owner. Okay, so you can have two extra staff accounts. You can have four locations, track inventory and fulfill orders at locations. Okay, so we can have four. You got Shopify for retail, Shopify POS for markets and events. Okay, okay so I'm going to click on choose this plan, the basic Shopify. So confirm basic Shopify plan, billing cycle, choose how often you'd like to be billed. So every 30 days, $29. If you do every year, you will save $36. If you do every two years, you will save $138. And if you do three years, you will save $261. Okay, so choose one of these. I'm going to choose $29. Then you can choose payment method. Choose how you like to pay for Shopify. You can choose credit card. So add a credit card and use it to pay your bills or you can choose PayPal. Okay, so I'm gonna choose add credit card. And just add your credit card information like so and then click on confirm and you will not get charged during the 14 day free trial and as you can see here you will be charged 29 dollars usd plus tax on february the 7th in 2020 when your trial ends so you will not get charged right now only in 14 days if you not cancel your uh, Shopify store, okay? You can also see here, build now zero dollars, okay? Then click on start plan. Okay, so everything is set up with uh, the Shopify free trial and the payment. And we're gonna go through all of these. We got home, orders, products, customers, analytics, marketing, discounts, and apps. We also got online store with themes, blog posts, pages, navigation, domains, preferences, and we got settings right here. We're gonna go through all of these uh, during this uh, Shopify tutorials for beginners. And now we're gonna go to the next part. So we're gonna go and change uh, the theme to a specific theme that we're gonna use in this tutorial. Okay, so let's go to part number two. Okay, everyone, so I hope you was uh, successful with uh, setting up your Shopify store with a free trial of uh, 14 days. Uh, this is the end of part number one. Now we're gonna go to part number two. You find it right here. And also uh, leave a comment below if you have any questions. You can also subscribe 
right here in the right corner. So let's go to part number two, just click on this image. So take care and bye.